This is the easiest way to get open in one move on NBA 2K24, and it is none other than the auto crab. And all you're going to want to do is put on Luka Doncic step back. If the ball's uh -huh. in your left hand, you hold R2, flick to the right, and press down shortly after with the left stick. If the ball's in your right hand, you flick to the left while holding R2 and press down shortly after with the left stick. Now, what makes this move so deadly is you can spam it if you just flick back and forth, left, right, all while holding down. It's very simple to do. And it just was really good to do. Like, you could just add it to your arsenal and just get open every Man. time. Like, it literally goes through the defender. I can't believe they put something like this in the game. All you got to do is just hit R2 and flick to the side and flick down. And if they press you, they can't because you're right around them. It's an easy three. I use it all the time. Every single time with this move, it makes no sense. Look at me. I'm just doing it. Look at me. This doesn't make sense. It's literally unguardable, people. Hit the like, hit the follow for more tutorials, because oh my goodness. This is the e this is the easy. Look, y'all make sure y'all follow Steezo on TikTok, man. He dropped a uh, little tutorial, right? And I'm going to go over this move and another Luca spam cheese move that y'all probably don't know about. I'm going to go over the L2 cancel, the left stick cancel, and some other moves. You're going to learn some things that Steezo do, man. So look, guys, this game is completely broken. It was already completely broken. There's already moves that put you right in front of your defender, like 2K23. But now with this, it's so easy. This is why Sim Nation, they don't, they create things like this for Sim Nation. 22 and 24, easiest ways to score. This game is extremely broken and very arcadey, but they say it's realistic, okay? Now look, look, I'm going to show you me doing it. The game is corny. Y'all seen how I did it, dog. Okay, it's broken. I'm gonna show you another Luca cheese move, right? Now this isn't as effective as that. Um, I knew about this Luca spam for a while. I just don't drop tutorials because I just think the game just cooks. I don't think really nobody interested. But here's another Luca one. You're gonna want to now. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to hold R2 and then you're going to want to flick your right analog down and then flick your left and just hold R2 the whole time and then just keep doing that over and over again and you will do a very crazy spam and everyone's gonna be like, whoa, what move are you doing? It's very fancy. You could do other things out of it, but it's not as, you know, but it's a, it's a fancy thing, look. You see that? You see that? You feel me? You look like a real crazy combo. -er. You know, you could look crazy, you know, you could just, er, you know, you could just, uh, you could do whatever or any type of L tools you could, uh, uh, you know, you, you could switch it up a little bigger. Uh, 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 you feel me? <laughs> you know, really getting a little jukey, you know, <laughs> you can only do this with Luca step back. Okay. <laughs> Hold on, wait, let me let me show y'all my dribble moves real quick. Let me show y'all my dribble moves real quick. I usually have John Wall on at the step back. I did want to use Luca so I could do dribble moves like that and other things, but you know, the John Wall really be getting you up. But now with this, bro, I mean, I haven't tried it live yet. I'm probably gonna try it tonight, so make sure y'all turn into tune into my stream later. Here, here are my dribble moves if y'all wanna, man. Um, but yeah. Just that John Wall, man, it be getting you out of situations, man. Okay, so y'all got the triple crab, okay? One of the best kills in the game, but we saw that that was just a... Imagine if that was all year that people knew that. That's crazy. Now, the Harden combo was already bad, but now we got this. Imagine if everyone knew this all year. Now, look, y'all remember, like, 23 was horrible. That's why people who defend 23, you're just an NPC. You're lost. You're a liar. You, you, you just don't know what you're talking about, bro, because if you knew how to was Russell Westbrook moving cross or whatever, all you, that takes no skill, no effort. If you just knew about it, you knew about it. All you do, hold R2, flick up, I believe, and you're in front of your opponent. That means the game's horrible. Completely. They didn't patch it. They didn't do nothing. That means you can't call that some this 2K to the... Bro, it's broken. My boy, you couldn't do that in certain 2Ks. It's 2Ks responsibility to fix things like that. That's why we be getting on 2Ks head, flaming them. You know about the no speed with ball, then y'all come out trying to defend it. It's your favorite 2K. I love this game. Y'all are making people shut up, clown. <laughs> but look, like things like this, they shouldn't exist. It's kind of corny, but 
I don't know, man. I'm going to show you all the left stick cancel now. now all you're going to do is hold R2. You're going to hold your left analog up, and then you're going to use your right analog to go right and left, and you have to learn the timing, and then you can spam it back and forth. You see that? You see that? You see that? Now to do the tween between the legs, you're just gonna hold R2 and just, just watch the controller cam. It's the spider right there. All you're gonna do is flick your right stick one way, then your left stick, you know, oppo, more diagonal, and uh, your right stick more vertical and you're gonna time the sequences, man. You feel me? You can, you can see the cam, all that. Now the L2 cancel, man. It's simple. You see? You cancel out right there. All you gotta do is when you go in, you just hit L2 and then go. Y'all seen it. Y'all seen it on the cam, my boy. Now you're gonna wanna go slow before you try to spam it. And to really try to get the timing down, do longer runs, right? And then that's when you'll start to get it. You feel me? And even in the game, that works better when you're doing longer runs. A lot of people don't know that, okay? Some of these moves, I don't really be doing like that because I don't want, you know, I just I just be, I, I like to switch up my style. That's why I switch the builds I use so much. I could easily just spam L2 cancel and just, you know, gee, L2 cancel. You get L2 cancel out of every move. Real cheese head stuff, yo, man. Now the misdirections, man, you're just gonna hold R2. You're gonna be flicking your right stick oppo diagonal downwards southeast, like if your hand was in your right, and you're just gonna go back and forth, right? And your your left stick, just, just look at the controller cam. This move is not effective anymore because you can't burst out because Sim Nation just likes to just ruin the game, but it looks cool. You can use it to combo and all this and that but you can't burst out, which makes it ineffective, which is why people just do the same type of moves, unless they're just a dribble guy and they're trying to have fun and, you know, or, or you're just beating down on other people. Now, the combo moves, all you're gonna do is hold R2. This is very effective. You're gonna hold R2, right? You're gonna do your combo move. That means you gotta flick your right analog stick to the right real quick and then to the left. That's your combo move. And then what you're gonna wanna, wanna do is Kemba. That's gonna be your escape. Crab, changing your life, okay? Hey, don't say I ever ain't teach you nothing, man. Y'all make sure y'all like and subscribe, okay? It's very valuable information. I am him. If I go play park, I'm basically unbeatable, right? I can literally have a 100 win percent multiple seasons. Um, I've never lost a park game this year. Uh, I don't count the games where someone throws it on purpose trying to like just make me rage and like they're just like standing out of bounds, you know, and that's happened with a couple times. But when I'm actually playing, I've like never really genuinely lost to a team. I'm just so unstoppable because this game's so broken and it's so arcade, but they say it's simulation. It's so arcade. I could just sit there and just dunk every play. The only chance I have of losing is if someone Zenning's picking up or uh, pulling up. That's crazy to me. Like, there's really no more comp in this game because people don't find the game uh, very enjoyable. You feel me? Used to be some more comp sometimes, you know? I, I struggle every now and then, you know? In every 2K, I have a 95 plus, right? But in, in these newer 2Ks, bro, I'm just, like, unbeatable because it's just the comp just leaves the game, dog. You feel me? Like, there's no more park high win percents. Where do they exist? Do you got a high park win percent? Where are they? If y'all want any more tips with anything else, just let me know and um, I could drop a tutorial on it. You want me to show you how to spin around like Steezo, get this vid to a thousand likes. You want me to show you how to dribble with a center with no uh, dribbling on their build? Get this to a thousand likes, man. I just don't be thinking nobody cares. <laughs> I don't know. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here we go again. We're talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm at made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.